Chaser the monkey, and you know, Chaser, right? I kind of wish that you were one of the pets up for choosing here in the pet connection. I think you would be a slam dunk, although I know you're not a pet. You're a spokes animal. That's different. <laughs> Welcome back, everyone. It's me, Jack. Live for the Bucky House. We are indeed playing the pet connection. This is the game where uh, moments ago we met three dynamite animals. Can't miss creatures. Uh, each one of them brought a human handler who served as their ombudsman. <laughs> they, they were their spokesperson uh, explaining the merits of each one of these animals. And now that we've met those three critters, it's time to bring in our human contestant. Their challenge is to sift be three, between all three of these pets, uh, ask each one a clarifying question to learn a little bit more about them, and then pick their favorite. Let's meet that human contestant, Meow. Put your paws together, please, for Ashlyn! Hi, Ashlyn, how's it going? Good. Great, I'm so happy you're here, Ashlyn. Welcome to the Pet Connection. As you know, we are going to ask a few good pets a few good questions. Are you excited to play this game? Yes. Great. If you play your cards right, you're going to make a good, educated decision and go home with one of these pets. Bonus, we're going to pay for it. So, Ashlyn, let me tell you about the pets that we have up for uh, adoption and questioning here. We've got uh, Captain America, the cat. He's not uh, Steve Rogers from the Marvel movies. This is a cat named after him, and he is moderately patriotic. We've got a dragon from Raya and the Last Dragon, the uh, recent movie. And we've got Pete the Cat, the actual Pete the Cat, who makes sandwiches and stars in a lot of books. Uh, Ashlyn, what is the first question you'd like to ask? Um... You could ask a question of Captain America the Cat, you could ask the Dragon a question, or you could ask Pete the Cat a question. It's your choice. What? Um, Captain America's favorite food. Oh, good question! What is Captain America the Cat's favorite food? Well, I tried to guess that because, of course, he's here in the studio. Um, I, uh, I put out a bowl of food. Uh, he sniffed it and he walked away. I put out a bowl of dog food. He sniffed that and walked away. I put out a bowl of people food and he said, ah? And then when I put out a plate of Chick-fil-A chicken sandwiches, he ate the entire plate. So, interestingly, Ashlyn, it turns out Captain America the Cat just loves Chick-fil-A. What do you think's up with that, Ashlyn? I don't know. It's, like, crazy. Yeah, I think it's crazy, too. I've never heard of a, ch a cat eating chicken sandwiches, but then again, I've never heard of a cat called Captain America. <laughs> so there's your answer. Now it's time for question number two, Ashlyn. You could ask uh, the dragon. Uh, it's one of the lesser dragons from Raya and the Last Dragon. Or you could ask Pete the Cat. Uh, which one would you like to ask, Ashlyn? What's Pete the Cat's favorite color? Uh, wait, who are you asking? Pete the Cat? Yeah. Oh, what is Pete the Cat's favorite color? Uh, well, he's right here. Let me just ask him. Hey, uh, Pete the Cat, what's your favorite color? Oh, you, seriously? You too? Uh, okay, this is crazy, Ashlyn. Uh, Pete the Cat's favorite color is the golden brown that you would find on a freshly uh, uh, fried Chick-fil-A chicken patty. <laughs> Weird! Wow! Turns out these chicken sandwiches are really popular today with the cats of Kids Place Live. Pete the Cat loves golden brown fried food. Are you surprised by that? Yes. I'm also surprised by that. I thought he would have said, like, you know, pink or purple. You know, just a bright, bright color. All right, uh, maybe it's because he's colorblind. Ashlyn, it's time for your third and final question. Do you have a question for the dragon from Raya and the Last Dragon? Yes. Okay, what's your question? Is Raya the dragon's best friend? Oh, good question. Uh, actually, no. This particular dragon is not the, the last dragon uh, in the movie, Raya and the Last Dragon. This is one of the other uh, lesser dragons for in the larger Raya-verse. <laughs> and keep in mind here, Ashlyn, I have not seen this movie, so I know nothing about this dragon. I just know it's not the last dragon. This is like one of the other ones. It's like... One of the Santa's reindeer that's not Rudolph, and, like, you're pretty sure you know its name, but you're not positive that you know its name or what it does, and it doesn't have the bright red nose that Rudolph has. It's kind of like that, Ashlyn. <laughs> this is just a, another dragon. So, um, 
So there's your answer. <laughs> like it or not. <laughs> Ashlyn, it's time to make your pick. Would you like Captain America the Cat? Would you like this dragon? <laughs> or would you like Pete the Cat? It's your choice, Ashlyn. I want the dragon. And why are you making that choice? Because I love dragons. Audience, show us dragon! We've just made a pet connection. And bonus, Ashlyn, we're going to pay for it. One more time, audience, give it up for Ashlyn in Florida, who just made a pet. Oh, and look at her go. Wow, she's flying off. Well, have fun up there. Just a young girl.